Zambia, a country rich in natural resources, especially minerals. Here, the mining industry accounts for almost 8% of the economy, but mineral extraction has also had an environmental cost. You know, Zambia is a mining country and most mines started around the 1930s and by then there were no these environmental regulations. So people were just doing the mining haphazardly. To remedy this, mining experts such as Dr. Bessa Bunda have devised an innovative approach to mining that protects the environment, improves local living conditions and increases job opportunities. I'm the dean for the School of Mines here at the University of Zambia. And apart from being dean now, I'm also a lecturer. As part of the Education for Sustainable Development in Africa program, students are being trained in environmentally sustainable mining techniques. The ESTA program started, the, I think, around the 2013, 2014. By then, we had the very few students. We applied for funding to Africa Development Bank, and then the bank came to our rescue. And then right now, we have about 15, 16 students in first year. So the number keeps increasing because of the support from the Africa Development Bank. What is the Africa in 2017, the African Development Bank invested approximately $1.7 million to help fund this master's degree program at the University of Zambia. Most people who do this extra program are people who are already working in mining industry or government agencies. When they get a degree from the program, they will go back and implement what we are teaching them. My name is Darius Muma. I work here at Mopane Mufrila Mine, Analytical Services Department, as Assistant Superintendent. I have a total of 14 years' work experience in the mines. I decided to go back to school. The master's program in Sustainable Mineral Resource Management actually answers most, if not all, of the challenges that we are facing as a mining industry in Zambia and as a region as well. Zambia's Sustainable Mineral Resource Development degree teaches students how to mine raw materials in an environmentally safer way and in a manner that is much more sensitive to the needs of local populations. We had a field trip to a phosphate mine. In there, we were taught ways in which you can actually design a mine right from the start of the mine to the end of the mine, it is all environmentally friendly. The program itself has got solutions for the interrelationships between the mining and the environment. It also promotes the concepts like uh, you know, green mining and green technology. I'm sure with the skill that uh, we are getting from this program, we are able to transform this environment. At the end of the project, there will be 75 graduates from the master's program, half of which will be women. My name is Joyce Masinja Mutasha. I'm a forester by profession. I work for the forestry department. I enrolled in 2014, and I'm hoping to graduate this year in 2018. Mining is very important to Zambia because it is a number one foreign exchange earner. It is the number one employer in my country. Mining in Zambia accounts for 10% of the country's jobs and makes up about 70% of export revenues. Where we find mines, those places used to be forests. Where you have removed the trees, you definitely need to replace. And that's where forestry comes in. I feel that maybe I can make a difference in this sector by ensuring that those trees that are supposed to be replaced, they should be replaced. On the African continent. It must be understood by all of us, especially in Zambia, that mining itself can be done in a sustainable manner. My name is Dr. Juet Masinja. I'm a lecturer here at the University of Zambia in the School of Mines. The students learn a number of different subjects. This particular course seeks to ensure that the students have a very, very clear understanding that the host community around the mining industry are a key part of the mining process. This study has really changed my life. 
I thought that mining was just there to destroy the environment. But I came to understand to say that actually mining is a very friendly activity that can actually improve your standard of living. The program in sustainable mineral resource uh, management is very, very important for the whole world because we are thinking of the future so that the future generation does not suffer.